Hey guys, so it's time to say farewell to the indie set XWD71452. The A triple plus rating 7kg1400 spin washing machine. I've had this for around eight years. You can see it's corroding there. Um, yeah, so I'm just showing you guys. Ignore the stuff there, okay? Just listen. This is the Inex and it has all of these features. So it's got your feature for, let me turn it on. So it's got your feature for when you're, you've got to set it on. Okay, to operate these, you've got to set it on any of these. So sports is one. So you've got your feature for your trainers, your gym wear, your special coated items, you know, jackets, stuff like that. Then you've got, um, a, I'm not sure what this does. I've never really used these. Actually, I've never used these. Anywho, this is what it looks like. It's got a delay time, of course. Okay. Um, I'm keeping the door open because I'm going to be using it in a minute. It's got your start, pause. Okay. And then you're going to pause it. All your stuff here. And this is all of it. Now, the reason I'm changing it out... This is about eight years old or so. The serial number's even rubbed off. It's old, guys, and the drum is damaged. I think one time I was cleaning. Well, a couple of times I was cleaning behind here. As you can see, the ground is a bit grimy. That's because I can't get this out. Let me switch that off. I pulled it out like this so you could see the drum. Can you see that there's a lot of movement and it also has a lot of water here i do i do have to dry this out a lot um it's just seen better days okay it served me well i'm not gonna lie it served me well um but it's time to say goodbye it's got the plastic washers in there that's not the correct name i'll insert the correct name across the screen so these are like hard plastic and we've got a 7 kg drum all right and yeah this is the drawer here my drawer isn't bad it's just i've done washing yesterday and this didn't wash down but you've got your detergent and your fabric softener compartment you also have i think chai lock is there a chai lock on here I think there was a child lock on my other one. I, I never used this button. I've never pushed this button ever in my whole entire life of having this. But anyway, this is her. I wanted you guys to see her. I'm going to be doing some laundry in a second. So I do have a new washing machine coming tomorrow. They've not sent my delivery time slot yet. So, um, yeah, once the washer comes, I'll show you guys that. I'll give you guys an in-detail talk through of the new washer. So we've got about two loads of laundry in this hamper here. And we've got, so that's two. Actually, this is three because the towel is going to be washing on its own. So that's three. Unless we put the towel over here, actually. The towel could go with this. So that's one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we've got eight loads of laundry to wash. I'm going to try to wash the uniforms and stuff tonight before they come. I do have to sort the flooring out as well before they come. Like I said, I don't know what time they're coming. And also, I need to move this again. You know, like what I did for the cooker. I need to move this whole... That's recycling. But I need to use... And don't mind my dry, ashy hands. Let me not point. I need to move this unit again and um, take that off. So everything's... On this unit is more or less going to go on top here but i do need to wash the dishes this is not a dishes video but i'm just showing you guys real life okay and yeah so i'm going to come back and show you guys what i'm going to be doing all right guys this is what behind the machines looking like i accidentally started mopping without doing the video but i've got a photo so i'll show you guys but the machine is leaking as you can see there's watermarks rust marks from the leak so it's leaking and i think it's got water under it somewhere i don't know how it's gonna get out and i'm just thinking jesus hmm it's really heavy but i'm gonna clean behind here so there's a space for the new washer 
I don't know why they didn't tile the kitchen floors like with proper tiles but anyway this is what it is I'm just going to try to clean it the best I can I'm not killing myself I'm just going to clean it and go and shower and go to bed because I'm tired it's freaking late so yeah all right guys morning that's the best I could do they're actually coming up the stairs it's around 8 19. I feel so bad because they've got to go up two flights of stairs but say bye to this one and welcome my LG. Always keep your trunk open. Okay guys, here is my new baby. Okay, she is graphite. So she kind of matches my fridge a little bit. All right, she is silent. I want you guys to listen. I was supposed to turn the other machine on so you could hear how loud it was, but I was so tired last night, I forgot. So everything sort of like, you've got dial, you've got the on button, you've got the pause, which is amazing, I love that. You've got the tub clean, so these are the cycles here. Cotton Eco 40 to 60, so you could wash clothes that are 40 to 60. Do you get what I mean? Like, so your clothes that has wash at 40 or wash at 60, you could wash together. Mixed fabric, easy care, silent wash, hygiene, baby care, rinse and spin. It's got a tub clean, which is to clean your tub. It's got a duvet option, speed 14, sportswear, hand, hand wash or wool, and you've got delicates. And then you've got your bits here. So you've got intensive rinse, floss, pre-wash, delay, end, and add an item. So, I don't know how you would add an item though. Isn't this supposed to be, wait, doesn't this, isn't this supposed to have a drawer? I don't know, we'll figure that out, okay? How would you add an item on here? Guys, okay, I don't know. It's got the, Inverter direct drive moto. So, you know, most um, washing machines, they've got a belt that keeps the drum in place. Once that belt's gone, you get all of that ruckus in your property. So, with this one, it's not like that. It's actually a direct drive moto, meaning it doesn't have a belt. Top of the range. The machine is on and it's super quiet, but we're going to have to witness it on a spin cycle, okay? So, you get 10 years warranty it's got the child lock as well and just all of those bits as we get to learn the machine like i said it's an lg 10 and a half kg as we get to learn the machine um we will figure out more it's new i've never had an lg appliance so this is new for me and it does have the smart diagnosis so if anything goes wrong you've got the app on your phone to tell you what's wrong so it's kind of spinning but you could barely hear it it's just like a little thud it's fully up. that's a beauty to look at this is a beauty to look at listen it's just thudding do, can you hear it just thudding look oh that sounds beautiful can you hear it and it looks like it's got a little outlet there to let the water out of the seal that's good. You see that little thing in the middle? So we're gonna let it get onto a spin cycle and then I'll come back and let you guys know. So the option it's on right now is speed 14, by the way, I didn't say that. Sorry, you could see where it's lit up. 
Water keeps coming up the sink. I hate that. It's spinning, but you can't hear it, can you? Amazing. There she goes. Silence. Yes. Yes. What noise? What noise? It sounds like when the plane's taking off. What a beauty. Yes. You know when the plane's on the runway and it just makes that amazing sound. Yes. Okay. Listen to her go. So, we're going to open the drawer. So, this is our drawer here. Fabric softener. Um, not sure what that is. We'll read the manual and then your detergent. But the blue bit is your fabric softener. And I like the fact that it comes out. And I think we should be able to detach it by pushing this and the drawer comes out. I think. Don't quote me. But I'll let you guys know as time progresses. Now let me see if there's anything else I need to let you know. It sings, guys. I missed that. I had you guys pause. It sings when the cycle's finished. I'm so sorry, I missed the singing part. Okay guys, I'm about to wrap this video up. Like I said, this is the appliance, it's nice. Once you finish doing a wash, it is recommended always to get a clean cloth and dry out your rubber area here. Dry any excess water, clean around this bit as well and leave the door ajar so it doesn't get moldy it doesn't smell funky another cool feature the lifters in this washing machine these are called the lifters so you know in your front loader you might have some sort of grayish ones those are called lifters but these lifters in this particular one they're stainless steel lifters so you don't have to worry about them breaking off and as i'm spinning the drum secure definitely amazing okay can't really hear any noise and another cool feature is the drain pump so this is your drain pump here and i love the fact that it's got a hose so this is your hose that's your bit that you sort of unscrew and you know you clean it out and you've got your hose there to drain it right here so you just sort of pull that out and you'd get it nice and drained into a bowl. My old washer, it didn't have a hose. It was a nightmare to drain. When you're draining it, it runs all the way back up onto the machine, which is not ideal. So, great investment. I'm going to start doing my laundry because I've got about eight loads to do. And it is 9.26 a.m. Okay, and I've barely got any sleep. So, I hope you enjoy the video. Any questions, leave them below. Once again, it's a 10.5 kg washer. It's in the color graphite. It does look stainless steel. It's amazing. And it complements my lovely cooker as well. You know, the handles on my cooker are like, a, you know, silver stainless steel. And also this as well. The only thing that's going to be white in here is tumble dryer that doesn't work. So we need to get that out. And we're going to be getting a new tumble dryer eventually. Um, and by the way, it's just a hot point. Okay, it doesn't work. It switches on, but it does nothing. And then it matches my fridge. So I love that it fit perfectly under here. I was a bit worried that it wasn't going to um, fit, but you know, I was a bit worried that it was going to bulk out a bit. Sorry, not that it wasn't going to fit. So yeah, it's an amazing plant so far. I've downloaded the LG Thing IQ 
app and I've got that on my phone so I'm going to set this up and get washing. I'll come and show you guys my first load in okay because that's exciting. Alright guys, before I go, I wanted to explain what the add item option was. So basically, the option can be used in order to add or remove clothes after the washing program has started. So basically, I will need to press the power button, which is that one, and then select the program, press the start pause button, which is that, and then press the add item button as necessary and just open the door after it unlocks. So I guess this prevents any water from leaking. That's what I'm assuming. And I figured out <clears throat> this is the pre-wash. So this is your detergent, your fabric softener, and your pre-wash, okay? So yeah, that's it. I'm gonna get the load on and then I'll show you guys what it looks like. We've got all whites and a cream. Right, let's get the door closed. All right. Okay. I've selected cotton and it's on a 1400 spin. Automatically, I'm going to select intensive. I also want to select pre wash and I want to do an extra rinse. All right, it's at 40. I want to change my temperature to 95. Okay, there we go. So you press the temperature button and you move it across. And I think that's about it. The reason why I'm washing it at such a high temperature is because I need to get the stains out. And I just like washing my whites at high temperatures. So that's the setup. I'm gonna add my stuff, so give me a minute. By the way, guys, you see how massive the drum is? Oh my God. <laughs> wow. Now you want to gently close this because you, if you slam it, this will spill over. So just gently close it. All right. And everything's set as we like it. So.
Okay, it says three hours. So it's about the same time as my old machine. These cycles do take long. And remember, I did add, add a rinse plus and an intensive cycle. So you can see everything's going on there. Now I'm gonna try out the add item options. Okay, I've pressed it. And we're gonna see what happens. All right? Because right now the door is locked. So let's see. Unlocked, the door is released. You can open it safely and you're not flooding. Amazing, brilliant. When I was explaining it, I thought it was a little thing that they put here that opens. That's what I thought it was, but it's not, but it's okay. So that's amazing. So you could stop it and it just works. Okay, let's go on. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. I would link the model number below and in the title. Thanks so much for watching. I'm sorry the video has been super long winded, but you guys know I really do like to share. So if you do go out and buy this, do let me know. And I hope that you enjoy your new appliance. Bye. I keep saying I'm going, but I keep coming back because I keep looking at the machine and I'm super fascinated. So the water comes out of these. So you've got one, two, three, four, and then I think you've got one up there. The water comes out of that. Isn't that super amazing? Wow. Oh my God. I'm so like, wow, wow. I want to go back to selling appliances because, geez, these have come a long way. Look at the water. Look at it go. Look at it go. Look at it go. Look at it go. Okay. Okay. Absolutely amazing. It's 2.33. I don't think it takes a full three hours. I didn't act look at the water oh my god I didn't actually um check but anyway okay and it's got the AI or is that a1 or AI and this basically detects the material the fabrics and make sure it goes on the proper you know cycle so it doesn't damage your clothes and guys, please try not to use excessive amount of soap powder in your washer because it does create buildup and it does more damage than good. I know a lot of people, they like to wash where there's a huge amount of soap sod. No, that's not making your clothes clean because that soap sits on your clothing. It sits in the fibers, especially if you're not going to be doing that extra rings as well. And that's no good, okay? All right, let me get back to doing what I'm doing. Make sure you thumbs up this video, okay? Thumbs it up and subscribe. We've got more coming. You've got your main water outlet. So this pours the water out into the machine and the other jets that are around it adds water accordingly. So that's super amazing. I was trying to do this part so you guys could see that it does make a little bit of a noise. I don't know if it's because the floor, I believe it's because the floor is a bit unstable. But I'm going to stand here for the next five minutes and see if it happens again and see if I can catch it. 
and then you guys can see what I mean.